And they're off, and Partake breaks alertly. So too does Kiss, and Kiss races up to grab the lead. Partake is racing in second. Edith Trudis comes on to grab third. Zdorsky down toward the inside, fourth. World Showcase is out in fifth. We bit mischief, far outside, racing up from sixth. Stair step to heaven, advancing down inside. Seventh, Cat's Cave is eighth. So in tap is ninth, and already six lengths off the lead. Then a shimmering allure, and at the back is Dancing Princess as the field rounds the far turn. And it's Kiss in front, in front by a length. Edis Trudis right there racing second. Zadorsky tucked away toward the inside third for the run past the quarter pole. Stairs step to heaven, switched out fifth as the field hits the top of the stretch. And Zadorsky cut the corner off the turn and comes on through. Zadorsky to head to head with Kiss. Kiss emboldened by the challenge fights back. Zadorsky and Kiss nip tuck final 16th coming. Kiss in front. Zadorsky continues to fight on. These two to the wire. It's going to be close. Kiss got it. Kiss the winner. Zadorsky was second. Stair stepped to heaven was third. Edis Trudis was fourth. They're in the gate. And they're off. Lupo's legacy pinched back at the start, shuffled back three lengths. Lamutanati's out looking for the lead. Supreme League is there. Might as well run. Comes on as well. And on the outside is Aeronaut as the field advances down the back stretch. And it is Lamutanati out there to set the pace and steps out now. Steps out by two and a half. Supremely down inside racing second. Aeronaut is now third. Rider special advancing outside from fourth. Might as well run was in tight down the back stretch run. Lupo's legacies moved up one spot and stand for freedom is at the back of the pack. Round the far turn. The opening quarter goes in 22 and one. Lamutanati in control midway round the turn leads by a length and a quarter. Supremely's down inside now coming off the rail with more pressure. Aeronaut is there. Here comes Ryder Special coming up three or four wide. Lupo's legacy is very wide in the track. Might as well runs in behind and at the back is Stand for Freedom. And up top is Lamutanati who rolls off the turn in front by two. Supremely set down for the drive. Ryder Special down the center. Then it's Aeronaut and might as well run coming out of the final 16th. Lamutanati spurts away, spurts away by three, and will go on to victory. Lamutanati by three lengths right on the wire. Ryder specials up for second, might as well run was third, and supremely was fourth. They're in the gate. And they're off. And take the charge, bounces out on top. Extra Nejo with some speed as well. Then Classic Legacy is there too. So they move into the first turn and it's take the charge who steps out. Steps out to lead by two and a half. Extra Anejo tracking the pace with Western Ghent. They're together second and third. Three lengths back. Classic Legacy is fourth. And Tallboys fifth onto the back stretch run. Take the charge. Keyed up. Pumped up. Builds a five length lead as they turn. So it is. Take the charge. Heading down the back stretch. Clear of Extra Anejo, who's now second. Western Ghent cruising along inside while third. Three lengths back. Tallboys in fourth. And Classic Legacy is already ten lengths off the lead in fifth. And that opening quarter for Take the Charge was 22 and 3 fifth seconds. Punishing pace, far turn run. Take the Charge, the lead's down to four now. Extra Anejo is on the march. Now to within two and a half as they round the far turn. And Tallboy comes alive. Here's Tallboy revving up in the outside third. Western Ghent is fourth and Classic Legacy is fifth. Round the far turn and Extra Anejo inhales Take the Charge. Extra Anejo heads for the quarter pole in front. Tallboy hard on his heel second. These two, one, two off the turn. Four lengths back to Western Ghent. Take the charge in Classic Legacy. Extra Anejo rolls off the turn. Has opened up to a four length lead. Tallboy trying hard, but Tallboy second. The rest way far behind. Extra Anejo with a dazzling effort at the pea patch. Geared down to win it by six lengths over Tallboy, who was second by a dozen. Classic Legacy third. They're in the gate. And they're off. 
Sergeant Counselor broke on top and bumbled soon thereafter. Kvetching Ma down inside the way well. Gary's Flying Lion comes up on through, and Boudin is prominent too. Third of the outside. Hale Allen advances up to grab fourth. Scotch No Rocks is racing fifth. Close knit advancing down inside six. Sergeant Counselor's back in seventh. Stay in your lane. Also along in ninth and only five lengths off the lead. And it's a big break back to Secret Edge, who's been out sprinted so far. The opening quarter knocked out in 22 and 3. They hit the far turn. Kvetching Ma, Gary's Flying Lion, and Hale Allen. The three of them stacked across the track with Scotch No Rocks right in behind, racing fourth as two lengths off the lead. Boudez under pressure fifth, but is advancing while wide. Farther back, stay in your lane, and Sergeant Counselor. They race for the top of the stretch. Hale Allen comes on to put a nose in front. Kvetching Ma fights on toward the rail. Boudin comes up on the far outside, and Scotch No Rocks tries to muscle through down toward the rail. They're off the turn. Boudin's in front, short lead. Hale Allen is there. Scotch No Rocks down inside, and stay in your lane behind that one. Final 16th. Boudin has taken over and has kicked away. Boudin down to the wire. Clear by two and a half, maybe three. Scotch No Rocks was second. Secret Edge from nowhere to grab third. And Stay in Your Lane was fourth. They're in the gate. And they're off. A tangled and awkward start for Copa Girl. Spots the field four or five lengths. Twin Mischief races out for the lead and Vanished is right there too. So these two will make the turn together. Twin Mischief down inside, Vanished right there racing second. Raggedy Sand comes on to grab third. Excellent question, sets up inside while fourth. Lacey Be Good shuffled back into fifth. Evie's Encore reserved while sixth. Then it's Catherine Blaze in seventh and slow starting Copa Girl settles in at the back. So the field moves down the back stretch run. Twin Mischief, a narrow lead. Prompted by Vanished in second and Raggedy Sand is right there to their outside. Three across the track as they cruise along. Excellent question is covered up, coasting along fourth and toward the rail. Lacey Be Good is fifth and only two lengths off this soft pace, followed by Evie's Encore. Catherine Blaze and Copa Girl is at the back. Onto the far turn, Twin Mischief given more rain. Vanish sticks with Twin Mischief. These two head and head for the lead with Raggedy Sand three wide and right there. Lacey Be Good spun out four wide in the far turn, but it's just a half a length behind. Excellent question is crying out for running room. Stuck in behind a wall of four horses. They head for the quarter pole. And Copa Girls picking it up from the back as well. Coming for the top of the stretch. Vanished grabbed the lead right at the quarter pole. Twin Mischief responds down inside. Head to head off the turn. Excellent question. Pops outside from third. Down to the final furlong. Vanished and Twin Mischief slugging it out. Excellent question. Trying to pick him up late. Final 16th. It's Vanished and Twin Mischief. An excellent question and twin mischief is determined down inside to get it twin mischief nose down first excellent question second vanished was third tight fourth lacy be good or copa girl they're in the gate and they're off Good start. Matt Adam mid-pack fires out well. Levy Proud is also there. Bugs him alone from that far outside post. But it's Levy Proud who steps out to lead and opens up to lead by two. And Muggsy Malone comes on to grab second, and these two head to the back stretch going one, two. Britt's wit not far behind third with Matt Adam tucked away fourth and toward the rail. Primer Dimer is advancing on the outside from an inside post all the way up into third now to within two and a half lengths of the lead. That puts Britt's Wit back into fourth and Matt Adam down inside fifth. Hey Boss six, Nordic Light racing in seventh. Eight lengths back to stud puppy. The trailer down the back stretch run. In the opening quarter, a moderate 24 and one-fifth seconds. And up top, it's Levy Proud and Muggsy Malone going head-to-head -head for the lead with a half mile to go. Down inside, Levy Proud, Muggsy Malone pressing these two head-in-head -head as they round the turn. Britt's wit is just in behind them third. And Primer Diners within range while fourth. Hey, boss, angles outside fifth. Mad Adam advancing down inside sixth. And as Nordic Light and Stud Puppy. They come for the top of the stretch, and Levy Proud and Muggsy Malone take their battle past the quarter pole. Muggsy Malone is up for a short lead now. Muggsy Malone heads for home and puts away Levy Proud. Muggsy Malone's off the turn in front by three. Hey Boss trying to come down the center. Matt Adams in tight in between with Brits Wit. The rest with too much to do. Final 16th. Muggsy Malone with a four-length lead, and it will be Muggsy Malone.
down onto the wire, the three-length winner. Tight for second there, Matt Adam or Hey Boss. Brits Witt was fourth. And they're off. Oh, and Proudfoot stumbled badly coming out of there and is three lengths behind the field. Obregata from the far outside post is racing out after the lead. Fastrazel's also there, and Electric Sense punches through toward the rail. These three mixing it up early. Love of My Life is on the chase back and forth, too clear of Just Like Magic, fifth. Four back to Proudfoot, who's moved up ahead of Holiday Decision, the trailer to the far turn run. And they clicked off a quarter in 22 and 2. Fast Giselle, the leader, the leader by a length. On the chase is Obregata second. Fast Giselle opens up. Fast Giselle builds a two-length lead round the far turn. Obregata's back in second. Love of my life comes on to grab third. Electric Sense going the wrong way. Proudfoot making up for lost time. Has moved up into fourth with three sixteenths to go. Fast Giselle's off the turn. Obregata to the attack. And here comes Obregata now. Fast Giselle set down for the drive. Obregata counters. One for long to go. Fast Giselle has to respond. Obregata has taken the lead and is open. Opening up to the wire. Oh, Brigada. Upset winner. Length and a half in the end. Fast Giselle settles for second. Love of my life was third and proud foot was fourth. There in the gate. And they're off. Tis of the slight bobble. Good start. Shady Empire racing right to the front and right there two tilted towers and slam dunk sermon and can't touch this from the outside so down the back stretch run they go shady empire going head to head with tilted towers these two open up slam dunk sermon on the chase from third can't touch this down inside fourth tis of these now fifth blue kentucky down inside six soaring bird on the move from seventh within five lengths of the leaders ahead for the far turn at the back spin benjamins and the trailer is solidify round the far turn tilted towers and Shady Empire go head to head and they tore through that quarter 21 and four fifth seconds. Tilted Towers, short lead. Shady Empire keeping pace. Can Hush this hovering in behind them third. Slam Dunk Sermon revs up on the outside fourth. Soaring Birds now fifth, angling to the outside. Solidify picks it up from the back of the pack with Spen Benjamins. Blue Kentucky's bottled up down toward the rail. They're off the turn. Tilted Towers, short lead. Slam Dunk Sermon comes on strongly. Shady Empire down toward the rail. Final 16th. Tilted Towers and Slam Dunk Sermon. And from far behind. Behind Blue Kentucky third, down to the wire, Slam Dunk Sermon and Tilted Towers. Slam Dunk Sermon got it. On the wire first, Tilted Towers second, Blue Kentucky third, and Solidify was fourth. They're in the gate. And they're off. And Tiwanaku breaks alertly. The Princess Spur toward the inside with Empire strikes fast. Sakil tries to tuck in as well as they hit the clubhouse turn with Tiwanaku out there setting the pace. And Sakil from the outside comes on to be second. The Princess spurs in tight toward the rail third, and so too as Empire strikes fast. In and amongst horses racing in fourth. My Uncle Leon, three wide first turn, fifth, ten gauge now sixth. Junior's gift toward the inside seventh, five lengths off the lead. Proveworthy is second to last early, and Caternian is the trailer. As Tiwanaku gets away with an opening quarter in 24 and 4. Pace is slow to develop. Sakil in no hurry to go by is tracking in second. Down the back stretch run. Tiwanaku the leader. Sakil second. A length back to my uncle Leon and the Prince's Spur. They're together third and fourth. Just two lengths off Tiwanaku. Then it's Empire Strikes Fast. Nudged along while fifth. Ten gauge sixth. Junior's Gift seventh. Prove worthy in eighth. And Katurnian is the trailer. Four furlongs to go for Tiwanaku. Hits the far turn, still in control. Sakil's been second throughout, is now starting to crank up the pressure. So these two round the far turn. Tiwanaku, short lead. Sakil right there. A length back, the Princess Spurs under pressure while down inside. My Uncle Leon is as well. Then it's Empire Strikes Fast. Prove worthy and Katurnian revving up from the back of the pack with Junior's Gift. They've got eight lengths to make up, though, and three sixteenths to go. And Tiwanaku to catch. Off the turn in front. Sakil's been second throughout and is still right there. In behind, the Prince's Spare and my Uncle Leon. Farther back, Empire strikes fast. Down to the final 16th. Tiwanaku and Sakil. Sakil and Tiwanaku 
The Princess Burr pops outside, final try. Driving finish, Sakil shortly, Tiwanaku photo. Nose is up and down, Sakil or Tiwanaku. The Princess Burr was third. There in the gate. And they're off. Shady Daredevil breaks in stride, and so too does Blocked, and Azteca Star is there, and Shibwe, and so too Cafe Racer, and backing out of there, own the field as Shibwe advances down toward the rail. So they cross over to the main track, and it's Shady Daredevil in front, and Blocked is right there, second, a lil and a lot, smack dab between them, and these three skirmish down the backstretch run with Shibwe on the move into fourth. Azteca Star's back into fifth, and then it's Cafe Racer racing in sixth, own the field is seventh by five, active duty is eighth by Bob White Bobby is ninth by another five. Fighting back in St. Elmo are a dozen, maybe a bit more than that, off the leaders. And the reason is the quarter was 22 seconds flat. Sharp pace. A lil and a lot comes on through, grabs the lead round the far turn. Blocked is right there, and here comes Shibwe. Shibwe comes off the rail, fourth, third, second, and coming after a lil and a lot now. And Cafe Racers on the scene, too, coming wide for the stretch drive. And farther back, St. Elmo and fighting back, forced to, forced to go very wide as they come off the turn, and Shibwe takes the lead. It's Shibwe in front, in front by two. A lil and a lot's back into second. Cafe Racers in third. Active duties in in fourth, final 16th, it's all Shibwe. Shibwe pouring it on late, clear by seven lengths to the wire. Good battle for second, that goes to active duty. Cafe Racer third, on the field in St. Elmo.